Hi there, this is uh, Ken Truman and welcome to another DCAC fly tying video. Today we're going to be tying a, uh, a hackled nymph, a beaded hackled nymph. The hook is a size 12 barbless wet fly, the bead is 3mm in uh, well, brassy gold. Uh, I won't go any bigger than this, but you can go smaller if you can find the hackle. Uh, the hackle is a partridge. The dubbing is a shimmer dub in pink. The body is stripped peacock. There's a hackle uh, prepared to tie in, that's the sort of size you need uh, for this size hook. The thread I'm going to be using to get as close a match to the uh, dubbing is fire orange. Uh, this is, well, it's, it's actually fluorescent, what Semper fly called fluorescent red, but in actual fact it's, it's fire, it is fire orange. So just start behind the bead, trim off the waist, break it off. And I like to build the thread behind the bead, just to kind of move it up and down, shank it up when you're trying to tie it fly. Uh, you can go smaller than this obviously, uh, 14s, 16s. You'll struggle to tie a partridge jackal on a 16. I'm sorry, I forgot to mention the tail. It's a uh, medium pardo. I'll pull them out so that they, you've got the ends lined up, roughly. Can be a bit iffy, cock de Leon. Just to uh, cash it in there. Just ease it forward until you get the length you want. You have a, you can go as long as body or shorter. I like, I prefer shorter, but that's only, that's only my preference. Really, tight to suit you. Trim that off so it's more or less in line with the back of the bead. Stripped peacock. This is, in actual fact, it's yellow. It's not a very good yellow. You need about an inch and a half to, to, to wrap. An inch might do you, but you'll struggle a little bit with, with an inch. So... That's about right. Thread back up to the uh, back of the bead. Cut the end of the peacock curl off, stalk. Re reasonably tight wraps. Uh, you need a really reasonably flat bed for the peacock. Now you need a little bit of varnish just to give it a bit more strength. Um, Strip peacock's not the strongest of materials, so just to make it last that little bit longer. Ackle pliers. Not use ackle pliers. If, uh, you could actually use one of them. That'd, that'd do you for if you if you've no ackle pliers or just ordinary ackle pliers. Um, Everybody prefers something different with ackle pliers. Don't put too much pressure on. I like to leave just a tiny bit of thread showing at the back. It's a nice little, makes a nice little hot spot. Just uh, 
just wrap that be careful you don't twist it hooked it back at bead turn over fold it back cut the waste off now I tied this both ways I found the best way to do it because you need if you tie the hackling now it'll more or less lay flat so what I like to do is just a bit of dubbing on but just a tiny bit more on that uh, and this makes the hackle stand up a little bit which uh, to my mind looks better so. so what I'm going to do with the hackle is I'm just going to put the uh, hackle pliers on it like that and pull it forward like that get hold of that there but the camera's like a mirror tie it in bend it back I'm just going to snip them off snip them off I have to be careful with partridge it's very delicate so I'll lift it up like that but don't put a lot of force on it and ease the hackle back so you're wrapping that with the hackle wrapped back and you usually get three turns Once over, like load it, don't let go of thread, and a few wraps. The back, I need to get rid of that stalk. Uh, you, can ch you can chance it and pull it, or you can cut it. And finally, you need a little bit more dubbing, shimmer dub. few straggly bits that I don't want but only because I'm a bit of a, a faffer you're going to tie it off there and the whip finish there but I'm just going to put a little bit of varnish on only a tiny bit three turns plenty Snip thread off. That's it, it's quite a simple fly. Maybe that hackle might be just a touch too long, but uh, it'll catch fish. Um, so you can see my point with using a smaller hook because you really struggle with hackle. Uh, you'd probably only get two wraps out of a smaller hackle. But uh, anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, if you're not subscribed, you subscribe if you wish. and. Uh, I'll see you next time for another video. Bye bye.